Hi, I'm Gareth. And I'm Charlotte. And welcome to Sue TV. We're in one of the beautiful shared apartments of Nido Student Living. Um, and it's St. Patrick's Day, so we've got a St. Patrick's Day themed dish. Uh, or so I thought, it's as bad as a mash, isn't it? Yeah, well, we're using Irish sausages and we're making Col Cannon mash. Now, Col Cannon is the Irish version of Bubble and Squeak. Okay, so what we're going to use is sausages, potatoes, cabbage, spring onions, sliced onions, and some butter. That, that sounds top notch. Uh, let's get cracking. Okay, so do you want to fry off the onions? Sure. You're going to need to do that in the butter? Yeah. Okay, and I'm just going to chop up this cabbage. So what you want to do first is you want to take out the root. You don't want to eat the root because it's a bit tough. And then we're just going to chop the cabbage and you just want to chop it nice and finely, just like that. Okay, and then it's just going to come out in nice little shredded pieces like that. And then we're going to chop up the spring onions. So you just want to take off the root. And then you only want to use the nice part of the spring onions. You don't want to use those leaves. You can just take that bit off there. And then we're just going to chop them just on a slight angle. Nice and thin so they'll cook quickly. When do I add the sauce to the uh, when you've got a bit of colour on your onions, have you put some salt in there? Yes, yes, yes I have. <laughs> put some salt in there. Okay, and then when you it's starting to get a bit of colour or your onions have gone nice and soft, then you can put your sausages in. What's the salt do? Does that draw moisture? Or? Yeah, it draws all the moisture out of the onions. It helps them soften up really quickly. It, that only works if you put the salt in at the beginning of cooking, because if you put it in halfway through, it'll just dry it out. Good enough for next time. <laughs> Okay, you can pop the sausages in now. Yeah, nice colourful onions. Now this would be the perfect time to make your mashed potato. We have actually pre-made our mashed potato. If you want to know how to make that, you can have a look at the video here. And then I'll just tell you, really simple, how to make mashed potato. Okay, now the sausages have been cooking for a while, we're ready to pan fry our cold cannon mix. Gareth, could you put some oil in that small pan for me? No problem. No. Okay, now we're just going to pop this in the pan. Yep. Careful, it might spit. Mm -hmm. You can stir that around with that if you like. Sure. Okay, so that just needs to soften up. As soon as that's soft, that can go into the mash, and that's our cold cannon mash. And then I've pre-made some gravy. Uh, if you want to know how to do this, it's really easy to do. You can just have a look at the recipe here. And uh, there you go, it's just really simple gravy. Just gravy granules and boiling water. Okay, how's that doing? Uh, I think my pork canned ingredient is softened. Just want to chuck it in with the rest of the mash, cool. mix it through, and you can take it over ready to plate up. Cool. In the meantime, Not I'm just chef. going to put the onions in the gravy. Well, look at that, look at the colour in there. It's all the green from Irish, all the, what is it, Irish grass, Irish emeralds. Shamrocks. Shamrocks, even. Yeah. Is it all mixed up nicely? Yep, I think just about. Okay, well, then we can just pop that in the middle of the plate. Oh, look at those. Yeah, not just sausages, Irish sausages. Exactly. Okay, so we can... Pop those sausages on the top like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, just pop that one. Okay, and then we're ready for our gravy. Looks good. It smells like Ireland in here. It smells like Dublin, Dublin City. Have you ever been to Dublin City? I've never been, but I imagine it's what it smells like. <laughs> it smells like bangs and mesh. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> but Irish bangs and mesh. That's Look good. at that, with the swirl as well. <laughs> There you go, so there we are, that's bangers and coal cannon mash. Fantastic, we're ready to eat? Yep, absolutely. Cool. Tuck in. Cool, cool. Cool. Let's get involved. Yep. Right, let's have a bit of this. And get a little coal cannon. Mmm. That's gorgeous. That's a simple take on a traditional Irish dish there. Do give that one a try. And that's Irish sausages with coal cannon mash. Bosh! You're going to find the recipe for that and a whole lot more on the website. 
and steve.co.uk. You can also find us on Facebook. And follow us on Twitter. And don't forget to subscribe for more exclusive content. So that's it. We're off to the pub for, for a cheeky Guinness. Uh, do let us know how you get on with this recipe and we will see you in two weeks time. Goodbye.